everyone, welcome to Yellow Cottage Soapery. I am making Tahitian Waterfall Soap, and this is a dupe of the Downy fragrance, the fabric softener Tahitian Waterfall. And it says it is, let our fragrance oil take you away with sweet jasmine, wild lilies, and violets with enchanting mist of a cool tropical waterfall. You will be in heaven. So, it smells very nice, and I love fabric softener smells, um, and this one is really nice. I don't know that I've ever used this kind, but it smells really pretty. Um, I'm going to use three different co color shades of bluish. This looks kind of greenish, but it's Tahitian Teal from Mad Oils. I have Indigo Girls from Mad Oils, and I have this unknown one for matte oils. It doesn't have a name. I'm going to have a base soap of white and I'm going to use the majority of the um, out of the three different colors here I'm going to use the more of this blue and then I'm going to use another container and I'm going to kind of do an in the pot swirl with mostly the blues and a tiny bit of white. Then I'm going to pour that in the bottom of my mold and let it set for just a short time. And I'm going to pour, um, I'm going to pour, what was I going to do? Oh, I'm going to pour the, the remaining colors in with the white and kind of um, the Clyde slide. Because I did it last night and when I poured it in the mold, it kind of resembled a waterfall coming down, I thought. So I thought if I kind of poured it the same way that maybe it would. But the blue at the bottom, I'm going to kind of um, do an in, a, in the pot swirl. So it's kind of like the bottom of the waterfall, like the, the you know, the body of water that the waterfall is falling into. So hopefully it'll sort of look like that. That's my thought anyway. Um, I'm going to give this a quick stick blend because I forgot to mix it up. It's got my um, kale clay in here.
everyone, welcome back. I'm going to go ahead and cut Tahitian Waterfall. And this is what it looks like on the side. I don't know if you can pick up the colors. Um, the bottom looks really cool. It's really swirly, which was what I was hoping for. And then this is the one side that I was trying to pour the colors more on one side than the other to kind of look like a waterfall. But as you can see in the video, I poured half of it down the side of the molds. <laughs> and it was a mess, but... All my molds and everything I cleaned with 91% rubbing alcohol, so it's, it was fine. I scooped it back in. Well, that's not exactly the look I was going for, but maybe once I get in the bar, it'll be better. And the smell is still really nice and strong. Um... I like this fragrance a lot. It's really nice. That's Okay guys, thanks so much for watching and I will catch you on the next video.